When a new denim style is put on a weaving machine, it's necessary to draw or insert the warp yarns through various loom elements. The flow of the yarn in the loom is easily seen from the illustration. The weaving process starts with the sized yarn coming off the loom beam in a single sheet or layer of yarn. The yarn then proceeds over a tension or whip roll that is designed to maintain a constant level of tension on the warp yarns throughout the entire weaving cycle. Each yarn then travels through its own drop wire that serve as stop motion detectors. When yarn tension drops too low or when the yarn breaks, the metal drop wire will complete an electrical circuit and the loom will stop. Next, each warp yarn then passes through its own heddle that is suspended in the harness. The heddle has an eye through which the yarn passes and allows for exact control of each yarn. The harnesses control the raising and lowering of the warp yarns. The yarns then proceed through the dents of the reed. The reed is a comb-like device that maintains the spacing of the warp yarns, controls the width during weaving, and performs the beating up of the filling yarn into the body of the cloth. The point where the yarn is beaten up into the cloth is called the fell of the cloth. This is the transition point where the yarn becomes fabric. The cloth now winds over the take-up roll, sometimes called the sand roll or press roll, which, when combined with the let off of the loom beam, controls the number of picks per inch in the fabric. Finally, the cloth is rolled onto a cloth roll. The threading or drawing in of the yarns can be done manually or automatically on drawing in machines. Of course, manual drawing in is much more time consuming. When the same end count and draw is to follow on a loom with a depleted warp, then a full beam of yarn can be tied to the yarns of the old beam. This can be done by the use of a tying in machine which automatically selects an end of yarn from the old beam and ties it to the appropriate end on the new beam. This can be done very quickly with minimum loom downtime.